Hello everybody, what is going on? I am Numnexus, bringing you guys here some Pokemon Showdown here today. Of course, if y'all didn't know, Volcano was officially denounced as a Pokemon a while back, which you didn't see. I actually made a Volcano video almost three years ago. So, I've had Volcano for a while. I've had a lot of people tweeting me, yo Nexus, Volcano's out, he's able to use a Showdown now, go, 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 go. So here I am going. <laughs> um, and fun fact too, Hoopla Unbound has been banned to Ubers. He actually was passed and he's banned to Ubers. So, for anybody that thought he was a threat, yay. And if not, well, he's gone. And now there's a funny, cool thing too. There's this option now where if you can click on someone's name like this, and then you click like that, it shows their ranking. Just like this in every, and everything. You know, I have the unofficial ladder or the official ladder now for the global ranking. Yes, this is global around the world, of course. So that's kind of cool that Showdown is doing that now. They've done a lot of cool updates. So shout out to the Showdown squad, a team that's behind this. It's really cool that they're going towards the means of becoming a little more professional. I like that. I like how they did that. So just a small little thing that I wanted to talk about in the video. But of course, if you can guys give the video a thumbs up for Showdown content. I'm loving Showdown. You guys are loving it. So by all means, give it a thumbs up. You'll we'll be seeing more. Since my playthrough hasn't started yet, you've been seeing a lot of showdown. I say that, but you've been seeing a lot of showdown. It's hard to record, just in general. That's why you've been seeing, I, I upload one day, don't upload the other day. I've been uploading every other day this week, and it feels really weird, so I'm sorry about that. But we're going to try and get into a match. I think my showdown rank is like, okay, is it not? Yeah, my actual showdown ranking is okay, so let me... Okay, so he has a mm, interesting team here. Um, what I'm actually gonna do here is I actually have a choice specs Volcano on because why the hell not? He's okay. If you want to look at his stats, we'll, we'll look at his stats after this. I probably should have done that in the beginning. He's okay. You know, he's, he's okay. He's most likely gonna lead off with this thing or the chomp. Um, I'm not scarfed. This team is bulky as shit. This is pretty much my hyper offensive, or not really much hyper offensive, like just offensive uh, dark spam team it was. And I just slapped on Volcano because he looked like he fit. So. I'm gonna go for HP Ice. I don't know if he expects it or not, but he's gonna go for Rock Side. Don't flinch at him, fine. Oh my freaking god, dude. Look at the chance that I have to flinch. 30% chance to flinch. That's crazy. Why don't I just go out to Landorus? <laughs> and he has no one on his team that removes rocks. This is a very, very scary. I could. Er oh, we're just gonna change rocks. Okay, I was gonna say I could Earthquake and be that guy, but like. Screw that shit, man. I think I'm gonna go for a U-turn here now. I don't think that he's gonna stay in. He clearly outspeeds me as well. Um, yep, so I'll go for that. Um, I could defog these, but then like, no. Ah, he's water absorbed. This is the Azumarill counter that we've needed. Because Azumarill runs rampage. Trust me, the mascot, I would know. And the only thing that Azumarill can really do to the thing, the standard set goes like, well, knockoff they can really do. And I have Sludge Bomb. But I kind of want to, don't want to, mm. Should I just, sh should I just, yeah? I'll do it. Just one shot. <laughs> you did not expect that at all, dude. It's crazy. If you hear a paperback opening, well. It's me getting my tea. I always drink tea when I play Shadow. It always relaxes me. Ah, but what he doesn't know is I'm choice specs. It's crazy how he goes into this thing, but then again, it is neutral. Um, so the only thing that I guess I can do is go into the Bisharp. Hoping that he doesn't go for like a sleep powder. Most likely he will, but uh, we'll see. He does go for freaking red like a book. He may have H HP ground, so maybe in the long run he didn't even really take a risk, but yeah, kind of red. Yeah, kind of red. I'll flamethrower here. If that was HP ground, I don't think it's going to one-shot me. This thing's defenses are kind of decent. Especially with its HP stat. Uh, it goes into the chomp. That's specs. And that is like 37%. I'm not feeling that. I'm, I'm not. I'm going to get this Intimidate off. That was crazy because Bit Sharp was kind of useful. He's going to declaw here. Um, I think what I'm going to do here is just go for an Earthquake. Is he just going to stay in here? Yeah, I'm just going to go for an Ice Earthquake. Yeah, I'm just going to go over that again. He's getting his 20% off each time, so it's a little tedious and annoying, but yeah. And him going out into the Talent Flame seems kind of unlikely. Yeah, okay, he's going to sack off the Chomp. Chomp did what he needed to do. I can now go for... 
defog and then put my rocks back up, but they're kind of like not important right now. 284. What do you think? Hmm. Let's try this. Let's do this. I may be doing something extremely stupid here. Yeah, it is something extremely stupid. Now I need to keep this thing healthy or I lose the talent flame here. Okay, this thing is, oh, wow, you're just loads of fun, aren't you? Um, we're gonna go for a Zen Headbutt. He might just go out to the Magnet Zone. Yep, that's fine by me. Um, uh, because I am locked in now. You know, unless he, what is he, sturdy here? It's yet to say that I'm not locked in. He's not even, it's crazy. I'm sorry if you heard that noise, by the way. Oh, it's warming stuff up. Um, but I can just go for a Flamethrower. It's crazy. He can just kill me off, too. Unfortunately, I am not going to be able to live long. So, Vakanion got a cool kill, but that's really it. I'll go to the Keldeo here. Um, I don't think he's going to stay in. But... Uh, let's... Okay. I was going to say, like... <laughs> I was contemplating, like, yo, should I just set up the substitute right now on the Roserade switch? But, nah. How nah? As a Roserade, it looks like it might... Be a little too healthy. You look like you're gonna be living a little too healthy, Rosary. You do. You do. Remember, buddy, there. Uh, why does this talent flame actually screw me over? <laughs> talent flame actually screws me over. I just need to kind of play around with it, though. Um, uh, here's what I'm gonna do. Since he will die to recoil, I unfortunately don't have bullet punch. Um, what I'm gonna do here is, hmm, he had HP fire, and I'm pretty sure that I can take it kind of well. So I'm going to actually go out into this as he just goes for a magical leap and gets an unfortunate crit. That's fine by me. Um, I'm contemplating right now going for a Meteor Mash. Okay, so I'm going to find out what I want to go for here. And I'm thinking I actually want to go for the Meteor Mash. But on the chance that I miss, it could be unfortunate. I'll just go for a Saves and Headbutt though. Which in the long run, kind of glad that I did go for that Saves and Headbutt. Can I win the Speed Tie though? So he doesn't get the knockoff. Off. Oh, and unfortunately, I do not win the speed tie. Crap. 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 Shit, why do I actually lose now? Why do I actually lose now? That thing is at 88%. That's crazy. Well, that's unfortunate. I needed to win the speed tie in order to win this match, but that's unfortunate. I'll just scoop another match, and we'll see how it goes. So this match actually came down to the nail. Score doesn't really matter. He had... Pretty much 1-0, since Talonflame dies hella quick, and, well, there's that, so. I'm gonna get into a different match here. A little unfortunate that I lost the first match, but... We gonna do what we gonna do, you know? We gonna do what we gonna do. We gonna do what we gonna do. Interesting team here. My opponent has a... Espeon Umbreon team? A Sun and Moon team? I don't freaking know. I've seen people do Sun and Moon. They're like, Pokemon Sun team, Pokemon Moon team. And I'm like, wait a minute. But the games aren't out. I don't know. People do anything nowadays. Um, but what I'm going to do here is expect him to lead off with the Dawn fan. And I'm actually just going to open up with the Keldeo. And he does lead off with the Dawn fan. I'm going to go for the substitute, expecting him to put up the rocks or not staying in. As he, uh, he does just that. And now I'm going to go for one free Calm Mind. As that Earthquake does pop. Can I get a burn though? Can I get this burn? I'd love to get this burn. It's gonna bring out the sturdy, but ah, it's crazy. It took a hell of a amount of unnecessary damage. I'm just gonna go for the skull again. Get a little bit of HP off. The only threat here is just I'm pretty sure I was beating everybody in this team, but this Espeon. Yep, this Espeon is kind of a dick. Just kind of a dick. Which I actually can go out into this thing, but I don't. He, there's a threat on the field right now, and I don't think that he wants to go. For the obvious move. I'm going to go out to Bisharp here. He can go to anything that he wants to go for. I don't think that he's going to... That's crazy. He has a move that's neutral. Forgot about Dazzling Gleam. Stupid me. Now, you want to stand and take a Sucker Punch? Or he's not going to take a Sucker Punch? Okay. I wanted to just do that. It's just a safe run, so... I Of, of course, I'd do it again. I would do it again. I'm going to go for an Iron Head here, though. I feel like he's just going to try and set up. He just goes for the Waterfall. Crazy. We got a lot of crazy opponents here tonight. You know, these crazy guys that are just not going to... And they fall for it every time. I don't know. It's these crazy guys that are just like not swapping out, you know? It's crazy. I just, but I just. Are you okay? 
you, you, you okay? He's gonna try to earthquake me. Ah! Volcanion! Yes! 4%. I needed that 4%. Like, you have no idea. Now he can go. Volcanion, kind of a powerhouse. Stop a choice picks on it, and he hits like 500, so. It's kind of wild. Now, what I'm gonna do here, he most likely has a Shadow Ball, but this thing is unnecessarily fast. Like, why are you so fast? If you look at Espeon and you don't see speed, you don't. Why are you so obnoxiously fast? <laughs> Good God. Uh, I'll go for an Earthquake. That's crazy, I don't even kill. Why are you so freaking bulky, man? <laughs> why are you so bulky? God damn. Or not bulky, yeah, the thing is a little bit bulkier than I thought that it'd be. Uh, can I just, he hasn't revealed uh, Shadow Ball. But I'm not trying to take any Shadow Ball damage. So I'll just stay in. I, I, the thing is denting my team. It's killed the Volcanion. It's dented my Zapdos. And it's... The, Espeon is a problem. Don't sleep on Espeon. A lot of people have slept on that Mon. I wouldn't sleep on that Mon. I would not. I was defog here. I don't know what he's going to do. Foul play? Okay. Um, so, so I'm essentially just dead. I'll try and get the Para. Be that freaking guy. But... Hopefully he's not a cursed Umbreon, which it doesn't look like he is. Umbreon is, seriously, one of the greatest evolutions ever, man. I freaking love this Pokemon, I really do. Ah, hold up. Wait, I'm gonna go for his substitute now. He knows my set. He knows my last move of Secret Sword. It's obvious today. He just forfeits because he knows that I won. Cool. So I got those points, like, this guy was, he was getting somewhere, he was getting somewhere. We're gonna get into another match here. Volcanion's kind of fun to use, not gonna lie. I think I ran the exact same set when I first had this thing back like two years ago. I don't remember, I had Steam Eruption, which... Is that a move? 30% chance to burn the target. Why do I not have Steam Eruption and why do I have Scald? Oh, that's my other Volcano team that I was building. Whoops. Um, okay, so I should put Steam Eruption. Screw Scald. Look at that! And the power- Yo, it's still- it's a 30% chance to burn. It's basically a buffed skull. It's crazy. That's insane. He's also got a Volcanion. Okay. Um, he's got like a bulkier Volcanion team though. It's gonna be- Look at this- Oh my god, look at this. Try hard team, dude. Hella try hard. He's gonna lead out with this guy right here. So I'll just lead off with this guy right here, the one thing that I shouldn't lead off with. Uh, pretty sure I outspeed regular Rotom with little to no speed investment. So I do, okay. Let him show that I'm scarfed. I'll let him believe that I'm scarfed. I'll go to the Zapdos here, he does go for the Will-O-Wisp. Unfortunate, but understandable. Now, looking at him, T-Tar looks like he's gonna be coming out. So what I'm gonna do is I'm actually just going to but the thing is, I don't know if he's gonna full switch or not, but looking at that, 20 base on speed definitely has bad him. I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna double out into this thing, expecting a T-Tar. If he full switches, I swear to God. Okay, cool, he does go out to the T-Tar. Now, what I'm gonna do here is actually go for the Scald. No T-Tar stays in on, on Keldia. Like, no Tyranitar does that. Venusaur's coming out, yep. I'm gonna try and get the burn now. Can I get that burn? Nope, I needed that, because now that's a Mega Venusaur that's in my freaking way. Well, that sucks a lot. I tried. He can now get a good read off on me now, but I, I tried. You know, I, I, I tried. It's crazy. He goes out into this? Insane. Um, I'm not forced to not go out into the Zapdos. He Volt Switches. I did not expect the Volt Switch. He definitely got me there. He's most likely going to be going out back into the T-Tar, and now he gets free rocks. Pokemon is mind games. Pokemon is mind games. Yeah, he gets free rocks now, so... He gets free rocks now. I, I, I'm i fine, I can just do this again. He may choose Pursuit. I don't think he will, he doesn't, he just wants the rocks. And now, I'm gonna Scald here and try and burn someone. Psych, I'm not, I'm Secret Sword and the Volcanium might come out. It's crazy. I got a crit, it's nice. Um. Okay, well I was stupid to do. I'd love to at least burn, I risked this, can I burn him? Oh, finally, yes. As he does go for the thin, as he synthesis, I can't say that. Um, I think I actually can go out to this thing. Well, no, he now that he has the Mega Evolution up, not really, but I, he's got—he's like a bulkier set, so I think I'm safe to just do this. Oh my God, this Rotom! 
I'm not risking this. I'm, I'm not. The use I have for this thing is not much. It stops you from sweeping, but I'm gonna play a very, I'm gonna do an obvious play because sometimes the obvious play is a safer play. He just full switches, okay. So now I have initiative. I actually thought that I'd live on like a sliver even after the burn, um, but unfortunately I did not. Zapdos, you really didn't really do anything and now rocks are here to stay, unfortunate. But Keldeo kind of wrecks his team. Look at it, that's half dead. Um, you're kind of a Keldeo stopper. If he was like fire poison or water absorbed, that'd kind of be a Keldeo stopper. Uh, it's crazy because I actually, Keldeo, yeah, Keldeo is so good against his team. I think what I'm going to do here is set up a sub because I don't think that he's going to stay in. I haven't revealed it. Okay, cool. So I'm going to go for a sub. Hopefully he doesn't go out to the Rotom. He goes to the Venusaur here instead. Um, do I just go for the synthesis on the, or the calm mind on the synthesis, or what's up here? He's gonna try and heal up. He's gonna try and heal up. Nice. Um, let's just attack. Ah, that did nothing. That actually did nothing. And if that one popped the sub, that should do like twenty-five. It's oh, doing over twenty-five percent. Pretty much. So I'm gonna go out into this thing, and now finally, I get the very free Mega Evolution off now. Um, so I'm gonna do just that. I'm gonna click Pursuit, because he doesn't have the HP Fire, so I don't think that he's gonna stay in. I could be that guy, get a little chip damage off on the Rotom. Which, he's expecting me to Zen Headbutt right now. I'm gonna Zen Headbutt anyway. He stays in for some weird reason. It just has to go down. So Keldeo is now even a bigger threat to his team now. It's crazy that he just let that thing go down. I did not expect that thing to let it go down. I took KO the thing if he's even physically defensive. That's how powerful the thing is. But I have to watch out. Mm. My best answer is gone. The use for Volcanion is dwindling. Or er, I don't really need it. Uh, he's not gonna stay in here. He's probably gonna bolt switch, and it'll do like a, it's super effective. Um, how about this? How about this? What if I scald here? Because there's two things that he could do: his landers or his own volcano. I was gonna earth power to predict his own volcano, but I don't think he'll do it. Oh, <gasps> please don't get paralyzed! Ah, are you freaking kidding me, man! Life just doesn't like me, man. That shit don't like. Hey! Are you. What? K. Okay. K. Freaking K, man. Like, Jesus Christ. God. That's the type of stuff that makes me upset, man. I'm not, I can't deal with that. He stayed in. Ice Beam? Oh, my boy came prepared. Uh, well, no one's gonna appreciate the Secret Sword. Like, actually, no one is gonna appreciate the Secret Sword. Like, at this point, you may as well let it die. I feel like he's just gonna attack me here. Wait, he doesn't have anything that he can really do to touch me. Why did he kind of chunk that well? Why are you, like, a threat? <laughs> uh, Bisharp? I don't think I want to use Bisharp just quite yet. He'll do terrorize his team, but then so does this once the sand is gone. Let's see, I'll go to the sharp. He goes for hidden power ice. Okay. He probably figured the Lando. Okay. 262. It's a speed tie, but is he running max speed? I'll be high key upset if he is. Because no Volcania runs max speed. It's not common. After it being like a day and a half. Okay, that's gonna hurt like hell. Um, uh, I'm gonna swords dance on this willow. Yep. Um, I think what I'm going to do is now again go for knockoff to be that guy. You might just stay in here. Oh, well, he's not. It's crazy. Uh, let me get this iron head off because even then it's plus two, minus two. So doesn't it put me back to neutral? He had a chopple berry. So I took that away. Cool. And hey, hold that for me, fam. Are you serious? Is he really going to be that guy? I'm just gonna go for another Iron Head. It's crazy. I'm knockoffing here. He knows that. Nope. I feel like he just sacked that shit off. Dude, someone's dying. <laughs> Bring out the Landers. Let me get that boost, boy. Let me get that boost, boy. 
Let me get that boost, boy. Let me get that boost, boy. I'll sucker punch now. Oh, are you freaking kidding me, dude? Oh, that was a good play, actually. That was a good play. I should have just gone and killed that thing. That was actually a good play. Well, the sand is gone. And I am very safe to bring this thing in. I don't think that he wants to keep in a T-Tarp in order to keep his sweep from happening. He wants to keep the sweep from going. He wants to have the sweep going with this Excadrill. So I feel like he's going to just go back out into this guy, which actually gets to a KO. And then there's no switch in because KO Diaz beats everybody. Yeah, Keldeo actually outspeeds everybody. It's still max speed Keldeo. You know, it's a substitute call mindset. So I'm fine. All he can do is bring out Tyranitar, and then I have to sack shit off. Wait, but you don't outspeed. He does. Crazy. He's a choice scarf Landers the entire time. So yeah, he's probably going to let this thing go down. And... Definitely now use this Excadrill to his liking. It didn't really come out to see the light of day. I still have a Landorus, but... Yeah. It doesn't matter if I have the Landorus anymore. I'm just gonna stay in. Okay. He has this balloon, man, that I can't seem to pop. Um... So, he has an opposing Lando that's kind of annoying. Do I want to stay in here and take a rock slide? I, I can't... Okay. Can I not get flinched? Okay, cool. Thank you. Thank you. What I'm going to do here now is go out into my Landorus now to get another attack drop. And then he's going to try and go for the Earthquake here. Now, what I can do is just let this thing go, because I don't think he's going to want to go out into his own landers. No, he's not. He's got that thing go down. That was a smarter play to do. And I could potentially win this. All I have to do is play it smart, play it safe. Uh, bless on that minus attack, though. Had I not gotten that minus attack, would have been just a little bit more scared. He might not lock himself with a knockoff, but... Yeah. He got the Intimidate off on me. Let's find out what he wants to lock himself into because this is a choice scarf Landorus. He he could lock himself into U-turn. Whatever he locks himself into, he just forfeited. Okay, he realized that he can't lock himself into anything since if he locks himself the Earthquake, can't touch me. Locked himself the Knockoff. Metagross is winning and lock himself with the U-turn. Well, I'm eating that up and I'll eventually kill you. And Stone Edge, I don't even think he maybe has that. So, GG to my opponent. I'm gonna scoop one last match here. I'm gonna scoop one last match here though. Volcanion is okay, man. It's okay. I still have never flex about the stats. Oh my freaking god. So did I say last match? Guys might be here for another 40 minutes. Cause this team looks fat. Like stupid fat. Like you're fat. You're fat. Um they always most likely just go. I don't think he's on HP Ice. What I think he's gonna do is Mega Evolve and Protect. So. The most aggressive player I've ever seen in my life. Like, no one does that. I can tell you that right now. Yeah, he just goes for the same approach. So me sacking that off now makes you a threat. Now makes you a threat. Now makes you a threat. How do I kill you? Kind of annoying that that happened, but... Like, actually really annoying that that happened. Because this thing is a stupid big threat. Like, who does that? It doesn't one-shot... I'm telling you, the, the type of players that never swap out, I cannot deal with, dude. Jesus Christ. This thing destroys me. I take a flamethrower, so this is the only thing that I actually can do. Is just go for his end head. Because I take a, I take a flamethrower. Don't burn me. Oh my god, are you serious right now? I, I, I'm just completely speechless. This guy never swaps out. I'm at a loss of words that this guy just does not. What the? What? He doesn't swap out. Of course I'd be fighting a player who doesn't freaking swap out. All right, let me sweep. All right, if he doesn't protect here, oh my, oh my life, dude. Hello? Why does he not swap out? The 
All right, let's try and get a sweep here. <laughs> Let me bring the game back, which I pretty much did right now. The Pharaoh's gone. He doesn't even get a chance to put up his own rocks. I'm guessing the Pharaoh Thorn had rocks. What are you going to do to me? Fake out? Confuse rate? Come on, Bishop! Oh, my freaking God, dude. I'm just getting hacked out to, like, to, like, oblivion, you know? And I knew that he wasn't mega, so I thought, fake out? But no. That would have destroyed this Sableye, and that would have saved my life, dude. Jesus on wheels. Jesus on wheels. Well, I still can win this match, but it's going to be very tedious because these two can kind of clean everything up. Um, Keldio is just a guy who... Oh, come on. Who plays like this? I I just can't... I, I, I don't even know what to do because I, I, I'm battling trash. <laughs> I hate this, man. Bishop legitimately would have torn. After that, he would have died. Oh, yes, you deserve that. And I deserve this. I deserve to burn now. I, I just never burned. It's crazy how I never burned. It's absolutely absurd. I'm going to go out to the Volcania because you're going to try and burn me now. Which he may or may not predict it. Judging on the guy that never swaps out. But hey, it's your funeral, man. I'd like to keep the Keldy around at least a little longer. But yeah, I'd like to do that. I'd like to do that. I don't know. It was upsetting to see freaking... Uh, we're gonna Bisharp not get that knockoff off, and then he stayed in and Hidden Power Ice. Like, everyone knows Hidden Power Ice doesn't one-shot. <laughs> oh my lord! Uh, so this, this, okay, so you, you're, you're such a big threat. You're such a big threat, Zoomerl. You're such a big threat, Zoomerl. Oh, Zoomerl is such a big threat. Why are you such a big threat? Zoomerl, you're such a big threat. But then again, he can't touch Zumeril. That's not a knockoff. Look at that attack st Look at that stat, dude. I'm telling you, you can either Assault Best and be that bulkier guy or run Choice Bex. But the Choice Bex, Volcanion, is the best set. Um... Oh my frick, I just don't burn. I, I just don't burn. I just don't burn. I don't burn. Dude, can I burn now? I'm at a loss of words. I mean, at least I didn't miss. You know how worse it would have been had I have missed? Okay, so he's most likely more than likely going to want to go for an earthquake here, which he does. I felt like Vol saving Volkinion because he got not only one kill, but two kills. And he's actually been doing a lot of work in this. I'm going to H Hidden Power Ice. And now I'm just going to go for another Hidden Power Ice. I have no reason not to. Rocks are up. I, I, you know what's surprising is that I turned the match around. You got to shake it off, dude. Shake the hacks off and turn the match around. I'll pop the balloon. Don't be some bullcrap ancient power set. Oh my god. On my life, if he gets a boost, I'll probably end my life. If he gets a boost, I will probably end my life. Do I go out onto you? I don't want to go out onto that thing. Kill off my Zapdos? No! Let's go out to Keldeo. Yeah, bitch. Yeah, bitch. Actually, had you gotten paralyzed, I could have honestly just gone out into my, uh... Buddy Volcania in there. That's nice. Almost at 1400 too. So I actually battled decent players outside of this guy. This guy was just annoying. This is just annoying, man. Like, never swaps out. He literally stayed in. He never protected. Like, he didn't predict anything. He just hit moves, you know? Some people take credit as, I'm like, oh, I predicted that. I, no. But that's it. If you guys enjoyed, of course, make sure to give the video a thumbs up. It means a lot to me. If you guys enjoyed this Volcania session, please, there will be more. Um, I like Volcania. So far, if we're going to look at the stats here real quick, they're actually very good across the board. Like, he's very very bulky and very offensive across the board. His HP stat is amazing. Had they given it 20 more, then that would have been a little bit more scarier. Uh, the attack stat is okay, but judging on his moves, Earthquake, Explosion, Facade, is physical. Flare Blitz, dude. You can actually run a physical Volcanion. It's possible. Focus Blast, Flash Cannon, his move pool is incredibly wide. Hydro Pump, Steam Eruption is basically the buffed version of Skull. Look at it. Third of the chance to burn a target, it is 110. Skull's base power, 
80. It's crazy. Add 30 points to that, dude. A 30 point stab with base 110. I mean, base 130. That's literally one point strong to kill Dio. It's a buffed Keldio. It's crazy. And he has water absorb, so he's a very good check to a lot of water threats, especially Azumarill, since he's uh, resist Azumarill's both stabs, being player with the fire sta fire resistance and the water absorb with the water immunity. So overall, very good Pokemon. That's just my thoughts about it. I'll probably make an analysis video about Volcanion, um, but he's good. This is the set that I run. It's pretty much suggested. I, I would run this set. I would. It's a good set. And uh, since you haven't seen much about it, I'll rightfully claim it as mine. No, I'm not going to claim it as mine. It's a very standard common set. But that's it. Thanks for watching, though. I'm going to get up out of here. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Shut up. Okay, goodbye.